<laughs> Don't think so. Hey, you got your brother right here. I wanted to call you because um, I have a crush on you. Oh, whoa! The cringe went. I didn't like. I didn't hear the last part because the cringe was too high. She said, "Oh, okay. You've met Matthew, right?" Yeah. <laughs> uh, I thought the cringe was bad, and this is oh, tabak the skull is the is see oh fuck oh shit. And Matthew probably standing across her right now. He doesn't have to. Matthew's her boyfriend, and he dicking her down good. <laughs> she said, "Listen, Rosh Kumar, uh, I don't need any IT help. We good." Yeah, yeah, your boyfriend. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you knew <laughs> this. This went. This was a dumpster fire in a car crash in a train wreck. All right, here we go. You knew. Here we go. And this, ladies, oh. ladies, this, this is some of your male friends. This is how they feel about you. Good friends. You could do better. You know what I call them? Hyenas in waiting. Do you know why I said hyena? <laughs> because a hyena waits till you're vulnerable. Yeah. That's the only time. They attack in packs and they wait till they have the advantage. Hey, a shoulder to cry on becomes a dick to ride on. That's right. Hyenas sometimes hang around lines and just wait for them to have scraps and then try to take what they can. Scavengers. Yeah, yeah that's you. You the piece of meat. Hello. Hi. What is up? Do you find me attractive? Yes, I do. Okay. Um. Imagine someone calls you and asks you that just randomly. <laughs> Yes. That, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. That mm, no no, yeah, yeah, that that's that answers my question. <laughs> that no more, no more water. No more water yeah. Nigga. <laughs> yeah, that's one of the that, feelings. And you know what's uh, even sad in that? Knowing you just gotta walk twenty steps to get the water, but you're like, bitch, I ain't leaving this room. Let me just dehydrate. Turn my other room to the Sahara Desert because my ass is lazy to get some much needed water. <laughs> that's, that's that's a 2022 problem. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah First world issues. I'm so thirsty. Walk ten steps. I'd ah. rather be on TikTok. Do you find me attractive? Aggressively. <laughs> <laughs> I find you attractive. Oh, Aaron. <laughs> you have a crush on me? Yeah. Yes. Wow. Yeah, I have feelings for you. I just wanted you to know. I got feelings for you. You're crazy, though. But you're <laughs> <crazy>. <laughs> I appreciate you, my dude. And you know the way she saw the way she laughed. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> she knew. All right, bye. Have a good day. Bye, Jake. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, I'm like shaking. I want you to call your crush and ask you to find me attractive. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, yeah. Are you crushing on anyone? Who are you crushing on? Um, a friend of mine. This leopard girl, the cougar. Yes. Yeah. Well, this is going well. Yes. 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 This is one girl who 150% Sucks dick with enthusiasm. Friend, do they know how you yeah. feel? Uh, no. Call your crush and ask if they find you attractive. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay. I feel like every dude who's got a loaf on his head has got to be gay. A loaf what? The loaf on the head, <laughs> they got to be gay. Like, nobody comps that haircut and, it, and it's not gay. It's the same way, like, every dude's got that, like, low fade on the side, mushroom on the top is a fuck boy. The loaf on the head is for gay niggas. Uh, just to catch all the semen or whatever, you know what I mean? <laughs> hey, yo! Hey, can um, you hear me? Hey, yeah, I can hear you. Um, I just wanted to call and tell you that... I love you, I just call <laughs> to say how much I care. Um, I have a crush on you and just wondering, are you attracted to me? Uh, I don't think so. Oh no. 
Just wanted to call and let you know that I think you're an amazing person and I've loved getting to know you and I think you're really cute and I might have feelings for you. Um, I don't have feelings for you. That's okay. I'm glad that we established this. <laughs> Yo, I got. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna tell you one thing. All hey, right. lady, lady, lady. I don't know. I love. I don't know if you're still with us on this planet anymore. Uh, all that copium you trying to inhale is not going to be enough. Uh, but I appreciate how well no. you took that. Exactly. I tried. My girl. My girl. I'm going to talk to you, my girl. My girl. I like you. My girl. I don't even know you. You my homie forever. Because the way you could take that L, mm -hmm. the way you take that L is the kind of people I want in my life to take L's. The way you took that L, wow. You took that L as well as you would want to take that dick. You took it so well. She didn't take it well. That's okay, I'm glad we can establish that. Good, that's how you should say it. I love working with you. Woo! Okay, I took back everything I just said. Everything I just said. Right in the fucking field. I'm sorry. But okay, it's still good the way you handled it. You handled it. But saying that to your coworker on T uh, on YouTube in front of that's, that's kind of But crazy. we don't know who he is, but that's fuck. The people at work know now. Yo. So that's awkward. Oh yeah. Just saying. Oh rumors go well. But you took and that. And then well. we put out a video, so if they haven't watched yet, they're gonna watch it soon. I'm just saying. But hey, you kinda wild for that lady. But 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 you the way you took it. Yeah, yeah. Be, be gentle, but what do you what do you rate my attractiveness? Well, on a scale of one to frog. Alright, let me stop. 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 That's bad. Let me stop. Oh, that's ouch. Seven. So like I was saying, on a scale of one to frog. I'm just sorry. I, it just annoys the shit out of me that like it's like you average. It's okay. He gave you a generous ass score of seven point seven point five. Kevin? That's generous. Is that you? Ma'am, ma'am, <laughs> ma'am, I'm gonna need you to stop it, ma'am. You're average at best. <laughs> I'm just saying, it's okay. You like Can I ask y'all a question? Go ahead. What the fuck is wrong with being average? I mean, at some point when I was in school, I was not doing so good. And I couldn't get 90s. I couldn't get 100s. The ADD was off the roof. It was crazy, but it was not diagnosed because it didn't exist at that time. And sometimes I hit a test and I had 75. I'm not failing. Mm -hmm. It's average. And I was happy to. That's what I could do. Listen, I studied. I never missed a motherfucking day. I was there for the whole explanation. I studied at night. Then I lost some sleep. Then there was this test. I showed up. I showed up before the test early so I could review my notes. I go to the test. I pass the grade. I did all my shit. I got 75. I did my best. That's the best you're going to get out of me. And what's wrong with that? Sometimes average is good. To be fair. 7.5 is above average. On top of that! I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah, I got a motherfucker that goes. Motherfuckers come to me and say, Preach, you a six. I'm going to be like, bitch, I didn't ask, but thank you very much. Have you considered, like, dating me? No. Have you 
ever had maybe possibly similar <clears throat> feelings um, about me? Um, I can honestly say no, Kai. I think if he has a brother, so I, I do apologize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think if you use a sister, you know, a sister I want to fuck. How you feel about incest, bitch? Because keeping it in the family is how you keep it strong. You know what they say? Blood is thicker than water. And semen is thicker than all three. So, what's up, baby? You know what I'm saying? Hey, let's go. Let's go. What? All three? What'd you think I meant? Uh, listen, incest. We don't know how to count, bitch. Let's get this. That's crazy, but that's good. I'm gonna have to give it to you. I mean, you know what they say, right? A mother... Blood is thicker than water. <laughs> semen. But semen is thicker than both. Bars. Technically, I said all three. That's a double entendre incest part. Bars. Because incest people. I... Are... Bruv. <laughs> yeah, listen, 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 listen. They say a mother's love knows no bounds. But can a mother give you this dick? <laughs> Don't think so. Hey, you got your brother right here. My favorite meme on the internet, incest is wincest. You know? <laughs> That's a good one, that's a good one. I like that one. Uh, How did that feel? Uh, I felt like I got something off of my chest. Do you feel like rejected? Um, a little bit. I feel, I mean, I definitely felt a little sting. It just kind of like went off the rails, which is like my love history for sure. I want you to call your crush and ask them, do you find me attractive? <laughs> Are you single? Yes, notoriously. I remember that girl. She who shall not be rejected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. She always wins. You can't ever get rejected if you kill them before they can yeah. say no. <laughs> Heads I kill out with it now. Hello. I was just wondering, you know, truly, like truly, not like what you're supposed to say. Do you find me attractive? Yes. That's it. That's it. That's it. I don't. You can't give me more detail. Yes or no question. Yes, I agree. Yes, I agree. Do you? That's a yes, no. You got the yes? You're not happy with that? Shit. Um, I was just calling to let you know that I have a crush on you and that I think that you are really cute and was wondering if you also liked me or have feelings for me. I'm, not, I'm like genuinely attracted to you and I'm, I'm, I like you too and I think you're really cute. Oh, thank you. I'm calling to let you know that I have a crush on you uh, and I was, I was wondering if you find me attractive as well. Well, with those bachata skills, like, you know, it's kind of easy to. <laughs> <laughs> I see you dancing bachata. <laughs> with those bachata skills, I gotta give you this dance. <laughs> <laughs> While we fucking, uh, I'ma play some Bad Bunny in the background. <laughs> That's what they get on. I have nothing to do about y'all. Hey, one, two, three, five, six, seven. Motherfucker, mix it they get on and by chata, papa. That's not the same thing. Hey, listen, listen, listen. You don't give a shit. I know. I don't. You hate both. Will you go on a date with me tonight? Yes. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll set something up then. Well, we should plan something for this week. I think that's what we that's what we need. <laughs> Do you want to go out when you're back in town? Absolutely. Um, I'm going to let you go, uh, but we can talk later, if that's okay. Okay, sounds good. Okay, cool. I'll talk to you. This can only end terribly. Let me see. Uh, dating dancers from out of town just means that they're there to dance and fuck you and then disappear. Get ready for some disappointment. Because if he liked your bachata skills, let me tell you, he saw a lot of other girls' bachata skills at socials. I believe we call dick's appointment. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Listen, the, the dance scene is fraught with uh, <clears throat> a little bit of fuckery. Mm -hmm. Do you feel me? A little bit of fuckery in my life. Yep. Well, there you go. People took rejection really well. Other people had some success. It was cool. Moral of the story, girls, speak up. Yeah, it can end well. It can. So. And if it don't, welcome to life. There you have it. Let us know what you guys think in the comments. 
And if you guys are enjoying today's video, be sure to like, comment. You already know how YouTube dealing with us, you know what I mean? Hiding our stuff sometimes. You can help us out by just putting it out in the algorithm. Yeah, yeah. Like, comment, do that regularly, hit that bell, all that good stuff. And subscribe. Bye.